Hello everybody. I want to show you my version of an electric piston engine. At first it had a commutator with brushes and relays switching the current but the RPM was really low around 400 to 500 so I removed removed it and, and designed an electronic ignition which which can be seen right here. After making a few corrections, the engine runs now at around 2100 RPM. But in the video, I will I will use uh, lower voltage to run it at uh, plus minus 1700 RPM. So I'm going to show it to you right now. Okay, so let's turn it on now. Okay, this and this. You can probably rather uh, more hear it than see it, but uh, yeah, the pistons are running quite fast. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, the the uh, the main difference between my design and, and the other prototypes where the pistons run inside of solenoids or coils is that. You can see them unobstructed during the entire cycle, you know, going up and down. What makes an impression that the pistons are not uh, supported at all. Well, in reality, of course they are. But at least I have really very efficiently cut on friction. The second thing is that the engine uh, does not need a flywheel to operate so it looks like a real engine works like a real engine and uh, feels like one too now i will demonstrate how it works uh, without a flywheel so i'm gonna take it off okay this actually this flywheel uh weighs 250 grams i'm gonna take the outside ring first and show you a smaller one well it didn't start it by itself so i can maybe use a screwdriver, a screwdriver so you can see it you can hear it rather this this wheel has uh, three centimeters in diameter okay i'm gonna turn it off now okay i'm gonna take off the small one so right now there is no flywheel at all, so let's turn it on again. And as you can see, it runs smoothly without it. Right now it's probably around 1600, 1650 RPM. So, okay, I'm going to turn it off. Okay, so feel free to, to comment on this. Thanks for watching. Today is May 25th, 2009. Bye.